Salazzo is known as a Turk. He's supposed to be very good with a knife, but only in matters of business or some sort of reasonable complaint. Hey, Clemens is looking for you. Over at the Falconite. I'm a Corleon. Play off. Hey, hey, the new enforcer. Congratulations. We all just heard the news. Thanks. It feels good to be part of the family. Glad to hear it, because there's someone important that you should meet. Salvatore Tessio, one of the family's most loyal capos. He's looking for someone to take on a contract hit against the Tatalias. Maybe you're the right man for the job. Mr. Tessio, it's an honor to meet you. How you doing, kid? Got a job for you. You're interested? Anything for the family. We got a problem with a Italian wise guy, Mikey Saleri. He hangs around that butcher shop you earned for us. Take him out. My respects, Sonny. I, I, I mean, Santino. It's a privilege to meet you. Do you have any advice for an up-and-coming enforcer? You know, trucks are a good place to start. I started by robbing trucks. I remember telling Pop uh, I wanted to enter the family business, that I could, you know, learn to sell olive oil. He tells me, yeah, every man has one destiny. Well, today, today my destiny is all about wanting what the hell's inside of them trucks and what it does for me, you know what I mean? You know who you're messing with? He's a good enforcer like you. Don's still in bad shape. Why don't you go over to the hospital in Little Italy and keep an eye on things? You think there's gonna be trouble? The police got the building under wraps, but they're not our guys, and I don't trust them. You deserve a beat, kid. Uh, uh. Don't let you better watch it. The stretchies are brutal. If they ain't fighting some other family, they'll fight each other. There are five families out there, kid, each controlling their own neighborhood. First, there's the Tatarias from Brooklyn. 
Bruno Tatali is next in line to be done and is working with that Turk asshole Salazzo. Tatalia's are tough, but nothing you can't handle. As for Brooklyn, the Heights is pretty rich, but watch out near the waterfront. If I had a dime for every cheap hotel brothel or sleazy clip joint, I'd be a very wealthy man. Look into the face of Estrachi and you'll see one thing, trouble. You don't want to run into them on a dark night in a New Jersey stronghold. At first, the place looks pretty quiet, all little shops and fancy parks. But watch out. Better bring a crew with you before paying the Strachis a visit. Hell's Kitchen is one of the city's toughest neighborhoods, controlled by the Cunios. They ain't rich. A few gambling clubs and brothels, plus some weapons. Hell's Kitchen is a sewer, full of burned down tenements and empty warehouses. The rail yards are a rat's nest of scumbags and late night wheeling and dealing. Midtown is the heart of New York. You got all those famous landmarks that you've seen in pictures. Plus the biggest hotels, swankiest nightclubs, and the most valuable rackets in town. One family controls Midtown, the Barcini. They're tough sons of bitches. Don Emilio Barcini is in charge and rules with an iron fist. And finally there's us, the Corleones. Little Italy used to be our turf. But the rival families kept moving in and hitting our businesses. We gotta stop them, kid. Take the families out one by one. But when you look up at that big sign, Jenko Olive Oil, you know, on Mott Street, that's when you know you're home. Like you want to talk to me? I know a secret about those delivery trucks. Could earn you a lot of dough. Interested? I'm interested. What are you thinking? Them trucks ain't all legit. Some are smuggling goods for the mob. Stop them with a little firepower, then interrogate the driver. You'll find out where they're coming from. The cook. The Barzinis. Nah, they seem okay. Keep to themselves, pretty much. I hear the Barzinis are good allies, as long as you don't. Hey! And Don will hear about that! Ha! I'm just going to the hospital to see no, Pop. No, no. I want, I want to send some bodyguards with him, all right? Ah, uh, he'll be all right. Salota knows he's a civilian. All right. Be careful, huh? Yes, sir. Send somebody with him anyway. Hi. Hi. Guard duty, huh? Yeah. You? I'm here to see Marty. Listen. Um, thanks. There's nothing I hate more than playing the damsel in distress. 
but I appreciate what you did. I guess I better go in. Uh, hey. Yeah? I was thinking, maybe we should, you know. No. No. We really shouldn't. But we will. How's it going there, Chief? Can I help you with something? Hey, no weapons inside. Hand him over. No problem. You know where Monk Malone is? You mean Marty Malone? He's upstairs, second floor. You get all this back when you leave. Hey, no weapons inside. Hand him over. No problem. You know where Monk Malone is? You mean Marty Malone? He's upstairs, second floor. You get all this back when you leave. You flowers should brighten the place up. Well, well. He's my kind of nurse. <laughs> so you decided to come look up my little brother after all? Wouldn't have missed it for the world. Thanks. He's starting to look like his old self again, right? What was that? Are you ready for an ass kicking? Go check out what that noise was. Time to die, Don Corleone. Don Corleone, come out. You can't hide forever. Now you're really making me mad. Get Frankie out of here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Who are you? Who are you? I'm Michael Corleone. Men are coming here tonight to kill my father. I'm here to help. Clemenza sent me. What happened to the police? The guards? I don't know, but I have an idea. I'm gonna get the nurse to move my father to another room. Now you better get your girl out of here. There's a way out through the basement. Go find Tom Hagen. Tell him what's going on. Hey, keep away from the front door. They may be out there already. We need to get to the basement. Come on, let's go. I'll follow you. I don't like this. It's too quiet. I'm scared. There go more of them. with lead, boy. 
boys. Follow me. We've got to cover the front entrance. Don't move. Not a fucking muscle. I thought I got all you guinea hoods locked up. What the hell are you doing here? What's the Turk paying you to set up my father, Captain? Take a hold of him. Stand him up. Stand him up straight. Oh. Told you not to get involved, didn't I? Attorney for the Corleone family. These men are private detectives hired to protect Vito Corleone. If you interfere, you'll have to appear before a judge in the morning to show cause. Get out! This used to be a respectable town. I could fix you up with a new suit. If Don't you, you like. know who your friends are? Hey, kid. Here's the hot ticket in town. So be there. Everyone who is anyone may drop in. Maybe you can make a few contacts. Sounds good. The party's over at Rose's. You know Rosa? Runs a hot little operation. Great for parties, know what I mean? Michael? I heard McCluskey gave you me You know that called Casino sign. Guy? McCluskey the police sergeant? Gal Casino? He that prick cop who thinks he runs this town. Yeah, that's... It was... What a bastard. Goddamn police got no respect for the law. A new shirt or coat can give you a fresh look. You interested? I guess I could use some new clothes. <laughs>
parties upstairs. Go and enjoy yourself. Hey! Huh? Look at me. I love... Hey, honeypot. What you got for Dolores, huh? I bet you treat the ladies real good. Hey, give me a minute. Can't you see I'm busy here? Hey, hey, look at you. Look who's here, Mr. Sharp. We're gonna have a great time. I'm so glad you got here. You got curves right where I like them. Flattery will get you everywhere. Ooh, baby, I just love the way you treat a woman. Take me home, Charlie. I'm so dizzy. Do I look like I'm enjoying myself? Nice. I'm gonna leave now. Look. Look, I got things to do, all right? Hey, don't point that at- ah! I bet you got a real pretty voice. You ever sing on stage? Mmm, you're a sweet one. Relax. Grab a drink. Hey, Belle, I uh, think I could get a little on the house, huh? You're melting my heart, lover boy. And one more thing, sweetheart. Why are you spending all your time knocking over poor shopkeepers? Don't you know the real money's in the warehouses and hubs? You look amazing. Really, I mean it. I'm gonna have to keep my eye on you. I can tell. Hey, kid. I'm assuming you can see. I'm busy. Go find your own party favors. Oh. <laughs> come on, come on, tough guy. Uh, right. Why don't you just give me your number and I'll call you, okay? Celebrities, are we? But well, we'll see about that. We're here, darling. I think I need to take you in for a interrogation. Son of a bitch. Something's gotta be done. What a cutie. <laughs> What's Sarge your name? Sarge takes what he wants, get it? Listen, Mac. I hardly know these people. I don't want to catch any trouble. Think you can help me out of here? Huh? No, little never hurts. And you got.